Welcome back to a brand new video, TBF Gaming, jumping back into 7 Days to Die, the Wild West mod. Excited to get going today. So we're working on a couple things. I got a little bit of mining done first thing this morning so we can get ourselves a little bit more cobblestone made up. Let's go ahead and craft that while we're getting ready this morning. There you go. There's 300 more of that. We need quite a bit more, but we've been going down here getting just a little bit when the morning starts up. And we had a bear out here earlier, so I'm a little nervous. That was our first bear sighting in the area. I don't know if we're going to see more of that. We've got a couple things that we need to do today. First of all, we're going to knock out this entire thing. This thing was an absolute garbage trash show. <laughs> this was a really bad, really bad build, really bad idea. We're going to knock this out, get rid of this completely, and then redo the entire entrance. Now we're going to redo the actual middle of the horde base as well. I'm going to try to knock out a couple missions today too. We'll focus on that just a little bit. I try not to do a lot of missions. They are important, and I know that that was kind of a big shift with this alpha was to make the missions more important. But we're going to probably only do a few of them because I just I don't like that being all we do. You know, just mission after mission. It gets a little monotonous and boring. But we're going to do at least one or two, and we need to get as much cement and cobble that we can from the buildings over there. So we'll work on that. But that's the main focus today. Get a couple things done. There you go. Have all that fall down. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Get rid of all that. Same thing here. And then we'll completely redo the entrance here and figure out a way to make it a little harder for the zombies to navigate. I saw a couple videos that I really like the ideas for, so we're going to try that. If I can remember the, the video that we watched, I'll try to give a quick, in the first comment down below, I'll try to put their name down there. It was a really good video on a real easy OP horde base. So we're going to try that for the entrance, because we're not using their whole horde base idea, just the entrance. But I'll try to make sure I shout them out real quick. But it's basically using what you guys have seen before, basically the jumping mechanic and them having to go up and around a bunch of the little platforms. Nope, back to that. <laughs> Have to keep switching back and forth here. Let's just finish it out with this. There we go. Alright, looking good. Alright, cool. That's all taken care of. I'll leave that there for right now. We basically want to build a little jumping platform thing, a little Qbert style thing that moves up to the entrance. And then we don't want them to be able to get that close to the entrance next time because the vultures could get up there pretty easily. Or we need to kind of figure out a way to close that off, but still be able to swing through it. I'm not really sure. I'm not sure how to keep those little vultures out. They were actually a pain. All right, uh, we're going to knock out... Were we trying to do just the outside? I think so. So we're going to knock out these ones, turn these into bars. We can just do this, and the thing will fall out for us, hopefully. And then, boom. Go all the way to the side here. There we go, and then we'll leave. I think we end up going too wide on the side. Maybe. Is that how we did it? No, we went all the way to there. Okay. We'll knock it out right there. We'll finish this out, put the frames back in. We'll try to upgrade if we can. We don't have a lot of wood on us right now. Might have to go back for that. I did just eat a shepherd's pie, so we're good on food and water. That helps out big time. I'm glad we got that as a reward. That's probably the only reason to do missions for us right now anyways. All right, got a couple more to do. Knock out this side. There we go. Nope, finally some stand issues. We are able to swing quite a bit there. I should have a couple skill points to spend also. We got two skill points to spend, so we'll take a look at what we can use those for. There we go. I'd really hoped for more of this to fall out, but that's all right. <laughs> We're going to end up getting like one thing to fall. All right, and one more. There we go. And done. There you go. And then we'll basically put bars up inside of there. So let's go like this, like that. And we're going to go copy shape. Where is it at? Copy shape. And copy rotation. There we go. Should have enough to finish this out, I think. Yeah, should be good to go. All right, we'll get all these placed. I'll try to upgrade them at least to wood real quick so they don't break on us. But this will allow us to shoot down below. Oh, no, I thought it, I thought it flipped. My bad. Here we go. We just want to be able to not have them pull up below us and not be able to do anything. I'll probably also get rid of, like, a middle one and make a little shoot where we can throw down, once I get this upgraded to cobblestone, where we can throw fire down at these guys because I do have quite a few Molotovs. All right, do I have a hammer on me today? I did not bring the hammer. We'll have to come back for that. 
And then let's turn these back to regular blocks. Copy shape. Boom. Boom. Got it. Got it. Okay. So that's basically how that'll look. That'll be good. We'll finish upgrading everything up there. Pick that up. And then let's we'll do the jump frame later. We'll do that in a little bit. I want to get over to the trader and do at least one or two missions first thing early this morning. And then we'll go back to focusing on the horde base by the end of the video. But I hope you guys are having a great day. This should be Monday's video, if I'm if I remember correctly. This is late Sunday we're recording this. This should be Monday's video. I'm going to record Monday and Tuesday's video back to back. So we'll have both of these right together. I appreciate all the comments over the last few days. A lot of good tips, tricks, and just ideas here on the map. The map has been incredible. We did explore quite a bit of the map yesterday. We went all the way up here, followed the road this way, ended up in the desert, got attacked by a coyote, coyote, almost died. Then we found a buzzard and stuff later on. That was fun. We went all the way over here. There is a drop out there, but I think we picked that up. We didn't get that airdrop, though. We got one of the airdrops, and then we hit up this one, which was like a fake trader that we definitely want to go back to sometime. So I have that mark to be able to go back there. The town was pretty epic. There's lots of big POIs there. So we definitely want to go back there and, and adventure through that. But every time we go there, we, we tend to get a bunch of ferals. So we got to be careful. All right. Uh, let's see. What we're focused on today, we're going to get a little bit more wood. I did move some of our stuff around. So it might take a minute to remember where things are. Let's go like that. Get about half of that. Let's get our, let's get our claw hammer. And we've got a little bit of gold. Nice. Actually, let's put a lot of this back. Take a little more, a little more stone, a little more clay, make a little more cobble. There's our cobble. Put the gold and silver up. Put that up. And put the feathers up, and then we're good. All right, let's go see who's banging on our door real quick. What do we got? What are you doing, man? Where are you at? Is there a crawler? Oh, we got a crawler. What's up, man? All right, cool. That guy's done with. All right, let's go to the trader real quick, and then we'll come back and we'll do upgrades as well. So we're going to kind of multitask a little bit, which means I'm probably going to get super distracted. But yeah, I really want to say thank you to all the patrons as well for all the support across the channel that allows us to run a bunch of servers. We do run multiplayer servers for almost every game that we play. We run a multiplayer server for it, if it has multiplayer servers, obviously. Like Infected, we play a lot of that. That doesn't have multiplayer, and I don't think they're going to ever add it. But seven days, obviously, we do run one. And right now, it is currently on the Fallout mod, which I think is a really cool mod, but it's not really for us. It's a little, it's a little different for us. I think I'll stick with the Wild West mod for a while. And then I, I, I eventually want to try Rebirth. I eventually want to try, uh, I think, Undead Legacy or Warzuck. I don't think we've ever done on the channel. Those would be a lot of fun. But I don't know. We'll have to see. Alpha 21 could be around the corner. They did have the... The dev update, which was incredible, uh, that they're going to do a video this week. So everyone was super excited about that. So sometime this week, I think it is, they have the video coming up for, or the dev live streams, I think is what it's called. All right, let's go ahead and check out your jobs, buddy. Uh, oh, we got 195. Nice. Take the one. Wild West Docks. I haven't been over there. Awesome. And we also need to kill a wolf, doe, bear, and lion for the current mission we're on. Let's also take a quick look at your inventory. I think we checked it out yesterday, but just in case. Oh, no. What are we doing there? Go to your inventory. That's right. He had a pistol that we wanted and a lever-action rifle that we want. A pump shotgun, maybe. Those are kind of the ones that we were looking at. And that really I cool got revolver. To do than stare at the likes of you. I know, man. I appreciate you. He's been hanging out with Rex lately. All right. The docks should be this one here. So let's go quest. We're also on the 250 settlers. We're up to 152, so we're doing great there. Overall total level, we're level 24, game stage 36, 390 kills, somehow three deaths. I know I only died twice on camera. Or, I'm sorry, once off camera, once on camera. And then the other one, I don't know. I really don't know where it came from. Oh, check out this little place. Definitely feels like a setup. Where's this crawler at? Let me kill the crawler real quick just because he's going to end up coming back to bite us in the ankle. Little ankle biter. Uh, should we double loot it? Nah, we'll just go. We'll just do it the one time. I really want. I would really like to double loot it, but. Oh my god, what is that? Is it just a regular little guy? Might be. Alright, we got to see what's over here. Oh, I missed. That's a solid shot, dude. There you go. Oh, good. Vultures.
Yep, come on. There you go. Oh, am I, am, I, am I still sneaking? My bad. Look how many zombies are in this little POI. They stack them in in this mod. There we go. Real quick clear. And I guess we'll double loot since we shot that guy. I don't know why we did that. But we're, we're committed now. Oh, God. Oh, the bike saved us. Good job, bike. All right. Oh, my God. Tom Petty zombie coming. There we go. Uh, I don't think he died. Try again. Nice. Very nice. Okay. Uh, should we bother with the birds? Not really. I don't know. I don't know if it's worth it or not. Okay. Let's go in. All right. Don't start it because we're going to go ahead and search it real quick. I don't double loot very often. I, I try not to. I, I do think it's a little bit cheaty, and I try not to take advantage this way. But sometimes, sometimes you have to. Oh, we got free loot up there. I will take it. Oh, nice. We get a slightly better pistol. Nice. A mod that might work. Pipe shotgun. I can't wait to get a regular shotgun. It's going to be awesome. This is just such a simple little POI. It's so good. But we've talked about it a bunch of times. The mod developers, we've been lucky enough that a couple of the mod developers or the guys that worked on the mod or the map or the POIs, they made a few comments on the video. So huge shout out to them. Uh, I know the, uh, I believe it's Medusa's, talked a lot about the POIs that they had a part of making. Some of those are absolutely incredible. Uh, even if they get me to say a bunch of crazy things on, on the video. Uh, let me see. Can I get up here? There we go. Oh, nice. I'm glad we came up here. Weapons bag. Ammo pile. Good. We need all the rounds we can get. And transport box. We got uh, two more wheels and a bicycle chassis. Nice. Okay. I think that's about it. Let's at least get the supplies over here. We absolutely need that. Definitely need that. Give me all your cobble. Is that it? Oh, we got one more here. All right. Good to go. I didn't know if those were worth it. What about these? Uh, it's 20 wood. It's not bad. Okay. We just want to check. I wasn't sure what some of those give you. Okay. Let me do a quick check of the inventory. See what we can do. We definitely need to read that. Uh, the pipe shotgun. I'll hold on to it. We can throw it in the base. We'll scrap that. Let's switch the pistol out. Let's do that. Let's go like this. And modify. Take that off. That's the only thing it had. Well, modify. Throw that on. And then throw that down here. And we can actually repair it too. There we go. And we can scrap the old one. Scrap that. We're going to be super overweight in just a minute. So I'm just trying to scrap a couple things. Okay, cool. Let's do it again. Here we go. Take two. I wonder if I can actually see the birds. Oh, we can. We can. I see one way out there. Higher. Higher, higher. Too high. Oh, I don't think I can hit him, honestly. All right. We'll just use a rifle. Dang it, man. I was really hoping that would work. Unfortunately, they're all going to start coming when I do this. Nope. Okay, that was the only one we were able to get. There's so much red there. Look at that. Got him. All right, let's clear it again. Here we go. Take two. Let's get rid of Crawler, man. <laughs> we took it down that guy, too. That power shot's doing good things right now. <laughs> He's down there in the water. Good job. All right. A couple more quick shots. Awesome. Good job. We'll try to conserve as much ammo as possible. Plus, the melee is just amazing. 
Alright, I don't think he's dead yet. He is. And last guy. Did we get him? Alright. Nice. I think that was it. Nice. Nice and easy. Easy peasy. Cool. Let's get that. Let's grab our quick loot here. Oh, there's a weird water texture going on right there. Look at that. <laughs> that's <laughs> that's a little funny. Alright. Alright, there we go. I can't imagine all the stuff that people got to do in order to make these POIs. Alright. We'll jump up here do the same thing again. We did this. Do that. Alright, search you. Nice, a level 4 this time. Even better. Right, weapons bag we got. A couple good things. I really like that. That mod is really good. Uh, some shotgun ammo. And last but not least, we've got... A wrench and another book that we can read. We'll go ahead and read this one. This is the Hunter's, Hunter's Journal, Volume 6. Uh, vultures are typically encountered in the desert and are attracted to wounded or dying prey. This is the best book we've ever read. Do 10% more damage to vultures. If you guys know what the vultures have done to us this season. All right, let's go ahead and eat you guys. Just kind of free up some space real quick. There we go. No overweightness here. Scrap that. All right, cool. Uh, we definitely got a new wrench out of it. Got a couple other good supplies. So we got two wrenches, which is good. We need one for the workbench. Perfect. All right. Grab the supplies real quick. Oh, my bad. Grab the wood. Hopefully we're not missing anything. I always feel like we're missing something in these POIs. There's so many good little hidden spots. Got the bag, got that. The wood and this. There we go. Nothing else, getting a little bit of cement together too. Okay, not searchable. Okay, I think we got everything. Back to the trader, man. Nice little quick run. I like the nice short quick mission. And that's the first time we've been in that POI too, so that's great. All right. Go back and talk to our buddy. Get a little bit of reward from him. We should be getting close to end of the tier ones. I don't know how many we've done total. We haven't done very many though. Incredible. All right. Uh, we definitely need some of that. I got plenty of the other ammo. Here's your bounty. Let's take your next job. Uh, I got a job for you. Remnant Old West. Probably the one we've done a couple times. But that's fine. All right, let's go do that. We'll do a quick upgrade at the base before we go over there just to kind of get some of the stuff out of our inventory. And I might throw some storage at the horde base too. But yeah, we'll at least upgrade the size. I've got my hammer real quick. There you go. Don't ride into the hole. All right, throw that up there. Where is my hammer? There we go. All right, quick upgrade on these if we can. Make sure the base is good. There you go. As long as the, the foundational area is good to go, we should be good on this. Any repairs there? It banged on it a little bit. Not bad, really. Get that. Boom. Get that. It banged a little bit right there. Not too bad. And a little bit right there. Not bad overall, honestly. All right, how much wood do I have left? Good enough to do this? Yeah, we can do this. We should probably go ahead and do the sides. There you go. Make sure that this doesn't break at all. There we go. This side here. Perfect. All right. Back side's good, too. Okay, and then we'll take these all the way to cobble as well then. And eventually to cement. There we go. Cobble. Cobble. Get a nice grip of XP out of this too. We're already level 25, which is great. Alright, good to go. Not too bad. Alright, let's go... Uh, we could do the foundation, too. Let's at least do that. That's probably a good idea. Get that. 
And, oh, that's it. We are out of cobble. Okay. Oh, I have enough to make quite a bit more. Let's go ahead and make that. And then we'll go ahead and do our mission while that's making. And I think we've done this one a few times. Is this a... Retrieve the supplies. If we can cheat our way in, we'll cheat our way in. But we've definitely done this PY quite a few times now. Oh, no. It's, oh, it's the old one. Oh, I hate this one. All the burnt guys. Okay. This one doesn't even have that good a loot to make it worthwhile. And, of course, it's up high. All right, I'm on fire, guys. Where you at? Come on out. I just need you guys to wake up and start doing your thing. Come on. There you go. Scared the crap out of me. There you go. Come this way. Alright, one down. Where are they at? Little center area, I think. There they are. All right, let's get that. Let's go open the door for these guys. There's usually one or two up there, too. There we go. <laughs> one down, two down. Level 26. All right, I don't actually know what way to go in here. We could just frame up. Do this. There you go. Alright, let's bring them over here. Alright, come on over, guys. Wow. Why were they running? Interesting. They weren't feral, were they? I don't know. I don't know what they look like if those guys are feral. Alright, we got that. Go ahead and finish getting up here. Like I said, I don't even know if this is the way you're supposed to go. We'll just make it up as we go. All right, definitely grab that. Oh, we should have came up the stairs. Got it. <laughs> okay, and then I guess we jump across. I'm not really sure. Some random stuff. Oh, there we go. Oh, we barely got him. Thought he was going to get us. There you go. Come on down. We must have to go up there somehow. Okay, stand up for me. Uh, maybe it's this way? Go up this thing? I don't know if that's right or not. We're going to do it. Okay, and then we go across. There it is. All right, cool. It wasn't too bad. Grab that. Grab that. Nice. Good free loot. Grab that. Another box here. All right. There it is. There's a bag back there. Grab that. I think that's about it. Nice. I needed more glue. That'll work. Okay, cool. Nice, easy, quick mission. I don't think we've actually cleared this whole place. Plus, I didn't know about the weapon stuff on the top. I think someone told me in a comment, but I never got a chance to go back here. I got that. Very cool. All done there. Any searchable stuff here? Definitely grab this. Free food. Alright, uh, we're a little bit overweight, but not doing too bad. I want to go into that one again, too, because I know there's loot in there, but I think the dogs are still there, so we're going to avoid them. And then the barn back to our right is al also has a little bit of stuff for us. We'll stop and upgrade real quick, because I should have a bunch of cobblestone again. There we go. We'll finish the foundation area. And I think the ladder, too. Oh, that... Oh, you got to go to steel. Okay. Nope, my bad. At least if nothing else, do like this outer edge. Make sure those are done. Uh, why is my stamp so low?
My stam is just flying down. Is it because we're wet? There it goes. I don't know what was going on. That was weird. All right, let's get that. All right, I guess upgrading stuff for being in the rain, it just it lowers fast. I don't know. All right, cool. How much cobble do I have left? Uh, we've got 160. Let's save that. Let me hit the base real quick because I need to drop off a lot of this stuff, and then I'll meet you guys over the trader in just a second. All right, back at the trader. We did switch out the pistol, so now we have that level 4 pistol with two different mods on it, and we put the... What was it? The... Cripple mod? The Cripple mod and the weapons lubrication mod. So it's got pretty decent damage. Oh, I might need to put a point or two into actual pistols. Great. Batter up volume 3? Or ammo? Oh. Power attacks. We're gonna... I really want the book, but I really need the ammo. We're going to need it for Horde Knight. Oh, there we go. Tier 1 complete. There we go. All right. I already have a bicycle, which is awesome, so we don't need this other stuff. Cloth bundle. Traps bundle. Ooh. A bundle of passive traps. Let's take that. All right. And then... All right. Cool. And then tomorrow we're on your Tier 2s. Very nice. What do you have for special job? Trade routes 1.2 kilometers. Let's get down Where is that at? Is that one we've been to? Let me see here. Oh, it is. Cool. It's the one that we've been to. So that we've been there. Nice. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and open this passive traps and see what we get in there. Open you. Boom. Oh, look at that. We got... Contract Eliminate Horde. Did I just get that? Additional contracts. Take care of the next horde. Can be found in wall safes. Okay. Placing the last defense item activates the horde. Wait, what? Wait a minute. So we put down placing the last defense item activates the horde. Spike trap kills do not add to the elimination total. Use with care. Hmm. So what do we do? We end up actually bringing a horde in on ourselves? I don't know if that's how that works. We have to kind of try. So let me grab our supplies and let's finish out the horde base. And we'll see if we can do this little mission. I don't really know how it works. If I get it to work, cool. If not, we'll move on to something else. Okay, we got this mostly laid out a little bit. Uh, let me get a ramp real quick. We need to throw in some ramps here. And I need to upgrade a little bit. And then it should be good. We need a couple more right there. But let's just go like this for now. Just for right now, it's going to look a little funky. I'll, I'll fix that in a minute. All right, just because I don't want to switch back and forth. Let's make another 20-something frames. Basically, want them to be able to run up to here without too much issue. There we go. I think like that. All right, and then we're going to need way more. 23 again. All right, one, two, one, two, three. Okay. Boom. And then one, two, three, four, and five. And then there should be a little corner one that we can put here. Corner, corner, corner. Uh, outside corner, ramp corner. Oh, no, no, no. We don't like that one. Hold on. Where's the right one? Is it this one? There we go. That one looks good. All right, like so. Like that. Like that. All right. So theoretically, they run up to here. And then we go back to blocks. Go back to the regular frame here. And then jump, down, jump, down, jump, down, jump, down, and jump. And they come right here, and then we'll probably remove those two. But that's basically, that's the general gist of it. I think it should work. The only part, they might run across right there. Maybe I should flip those. So maybe we should go like this. We should go there and there. Like that. Let's do that. Let's flip it by one. There you go. And like that. They might just jump across right there, but that should work okay we've got a bunch of upgrading to do I, how much wood do i have on me should have enough get my hammer down real quick all right let me see if i can upgrade this real quick and then i'm gonna put down these little traps
Okay, that's all upgraded. Good to go. Now, let's go ahead and accept this mission. And I think what we have to do is accept the mission. Read it. All right. Accept. And now... Uh, let's see. Tips. Bring all crafting resources to the rally point. Build your fortifications. You can add more than the required minimum. Activate the rally point and follow your instructions. Oh, you have... It's a specific location. Oh. Okay. Eliminate Horde Trader. Where is it at? Was oh, it at the Trader? Hold on. That can't be right. At least I got the Horde base ready, but <laughs> that's not a... Not exactly what I expected. The problem is I can't run this at nighttime. Where is it? Is it really at the Trader? Oh, wow. Okay. Talk to the trader. Well, I guess you ain't so bad. Here's Thanks for taking this contract. For your trouble. Hold on. We got someone coming already. Let's see. Okay, now we got to go to the rally point. Oh, okay. So it's not here. He just gave us a contract to go somewhere else. Which is over that way. Let me see where this is at. It is... Not showing up on my map. Okay, well, let's just go over to it and see. <laughs> I don't know that I want to try this. Like, are they going to be all ferals? Or is it just going to be like a walking horde? Very unsure. Alright, 300 meters this way. So it's actually in this little town. It's already 2100. We gotta be a little careful with the time, but worst case, if we start this and it's just a little crazy, we jump on the bike and we run. But I don't know. This could be the end. This could be <laughs> this could be our death over here. Let's get over here real quick. Check this out. No in my luck, I'm gonna get a wandering horde or a feral at the same time. It hasn't rained today, so we're okay. Alright. Still further this way? Just kind of in the middle. Okay. Okay, if I activate it... Man, let me see. Let me read the quest, see if it says anything else. Alright. We'll go eliminate horde. There's an infected grunt horde out there that has been causing trouble. Head over to the location marked on your map. Build defenses before the horde's arrival. Placing the last defense item activates the horde. Spike trap kills do not count. So we activate it. Place the stuff, I think. Yeah, there we go. Okay, stay within. Craft cobblestone shapes. Oh, crap. Now we're just in it. Okay, I didn't know we'd have to do that. Cobblestone shapes. Can I make 20? I can. Craft wood spike traps. Oh, this is going to be really hard. I didn't know I'd have to craft all this stuff. Crap. I mean, we can go get the supplies. Craft wood spike traps. Okay. It says wooden spike traps don't count for your kills, though. Okay. Let's see how much we need for the wooden spike traps. Wood spike traps. I just need five. All right, and then that's almost done. And then we need place cobblestone shapes, place the wood spikes, place the white river flagpole. How do I make the flagpole? Okay, let's look at the flag. White river flagpole. I didn't get a White River flagpole. How am I supposed to do Oh, wait. No, there it is. We have it. Okay, cool. All right. Uh, looks like we're doing this at nighttime. This is a super good idea. This is one of our best ideas. All right. Let's go. But we're committed now. Now we have to do it. All right. Cobblestone shapes. So we're literally going to make a little... <laughs> this is the worst idea ever. What are we doing? Uh, let's go... Let's go like this. Go up one more. Okay. 
As long as we're like three tall, we should be good. There we go. Got it. And got it. Basically, we'll just be right here. This is such a bad idea. Such a bad idea. Okay. Okay. And then we need to go like that. And we'll make a quick little hidey hole here. I need a couple more frames. Basically going to back ourselves into a corner real quick. There we go. Just upgrade the bottom two. The rest of it's fine. Alright, it is super dark. I will lighten it up a little bit for you guys because it's going to be really hard to see. They're going to have to jump up here, jump up here. Alright, cool. And then we'll go... Oh, man. Why did we do this? We really got to like start thinking about our life choices here. There we go. If there's vultures, I just give up. Okay. That one there. That one there. Need one more frame. There you go. We're going to go super easy like that. go and we'll go with a man I don't want to leave anything that they can get through just in case shape let's do some kind of bar or pole like a double oh, we'll do a couple of these weird looking ones here we go like that and oh, I might not be able to shoot through there though all right, we're going to risk it. There we go. I think I can swing through there. Maybe not. Dang it. This might be a really bad idea. All right, let's go like this. I got to break that out. Dang it. This is the worst idea we've ever had. shape let's try something else let's try maybe this one all right hopefully this will work okay okay cool all right now i just need a ladder to get up here so let's go ladder i know we can make it inside we're just gonna make it there real quick throw the ladder down Now we've got to place down the wood spikes. All right, so let's place down some wood spike traps. And we can put down these other things too. So let's go, let's put a landmine down. Okay, let's go like this. Just don't accidentally step on your own landmines here. There we go. All right, land mines down. Please don't step on them. Cooking pot mines. Hopefully these don't all set each other off. Like, they might be too close to each other. There we go. Put one down there. And what else do I have? I got a little bit of barbed wire fence. Okay. This actually might be a problem. Okay. Put that there. Oh, I can't get through there. Careful. Okay. Just going to throw them kind of a couple random places. All right. And then the last thing we got to do is place the wood spike traps. I'm just going to put those here. Just to keep them off there just in case. There you go. We don't really need them there, but they're just kind of there. All right, and then I need the flagpole. 
All right, let me lighten it up just a little bit for you guys. All right, I got a little bit brighter just for video purposes. Also, there's buildings over there. Check that out. We'll have to go look at those eventually. All right, last but not least, we need to put down the flagpole. We need to make sure that we are reloaded. And locate the bike for when we have to run. It's why did we park over there? <laughs> Such a bad idea. All right, here we go. This could be the end. This could be the end of all of it. Oh, it's huge. Oh, I didn't expect this. Okay. Um, there you go. Flagpole down. Oh my god, okay, it's happening. Alright, let's do it. Okay. There you go. Please, no vultures. Alright, let's use a little bit of pistol action. There you go. There you go. Get some free shots in here. We just gotta kill 16. Hopefully we can do that. Oh god, how did you guys get up here? What the crap? How did you get up here? What the crap? Oh, I bet they jumped over the top. Okay, careful, careful, careful. Okay, watch him coming over the top. I need you to die. Alright, get away, Pat. go. I know where stamina is hurting right now. We're at 13. Okay, hold on. Where's my where's my hammer? I got to repair. Oh, good call. Good timing. All right. We need two more kills. Come on, kill the big guy. Oh, I need that guy to die. There's 15. Oh, God, don't crawl through. Don't you dare crawl through. Swing, please, swing. All right. Okay, I think we got one left. All right, dude, we survived. We're a little infected. Everything's a little crazy. What is this guy doing? What is that? I saw something over there. There we go. No, nope, there's still another one. There you go. Let him do his hop. Jump back down. Is he dead, dead? Make sure. We survived. We survived. All right. Hey, I got to end the video pretty quickly here. Let's get back to base. <laughs> this is uh, uh, this went a little crazier than I thought. All right. Time to go. Hey, the impromptu horde base worked okay. Ish. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next episode. That was super dumb, but it was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Later. Thanks up for doing missions.